Hey yeah, guys, I just a little quick video today on uh, counteracting Xenon. As you can see, we got a, uh, a a core with quite a bit of Xenon, as it's burning away while we sit at three thousand two hundred megawatts. Right now, we've got auto control on. Just a little tip with counteracting it. Uh, counteracting it. So when you're starting up the reactor, um, pull all of the auto control rods out. Trust me, it will work. Um, normally if you're starting it fresh, normally it won't be as bad. So you can escape with the rods being at half. But, just be careful uh, in public service, people like to uh, press AZ5 and it will start to build Xenon up really fast as, this, as the uh, core is winding down. That's a little quick tip. As you can see, I've got a 43% insertion rate at the moment. So, right now, we've got a poison, well, not really a poison core, but like we've got quite a bit of that on in. So, quick tip. See how you can tell that the Xenon is burning away or still there if this, if um, all of the auto control rods are moving. As you can see, it's spiking up pretty fast. Just a quick tip. Auto run at controls rods uh, it could be, is your best friend here. So, as you can see, I have some rods selected. I can put those rods back in and what that will do is it will give a little bit more breathing room for the rods, for the automatic control rods. So what you really have to focus on is putting the rods back in. If that makes any sense. So as you can see I've got a lot of rods pulled out at the moment. As you can see the automatic control rods are about to reach 7, so I can just put more rods back in. And as I'm putting more rods back in, this will start to climb as it tries to compensate for the lost power, as you can see right here. Uh, it should. Oh, I'm still pulling it. I'm still... I hate when that happens. One second, guys. Yeah, um... One thing that really annoys me about this, probably the, probably the only thing that really annoys me about this game, is sometimes when you press a button, it won't like you to unpress, if that makes sense. Boom. So I try to put the rods back in, but this got stuck on when I thought I let, <laughs> let go of it. I obviously did, but it kept going. That's one of its. That's you know, really annoying. Anyway, that's a quick tip. So as you, could, as you saw, I put the rod, these, these rods back in, and the automatic control would compensate for that. So it will give more breathing room uh, to for the automatic rods, so they can continue to compensate for the burning xenon while I'm putting rods back into the core. So you can c you can manually control rods while automatic control is on. So a lot of people get confused by that. See so when it gets close to six, start selecting some rods you've already put in and start pull put you've already are taken out. Sorry. So such as like these ones up here, the orange dots, the outer rods. So I'll just select some of them and I start putting them back into the coil and automatic control will compensate for that and will give more breathing room for it for itself to compensate for Xenon. Hope that isn't too confusing for you guys. Penguin, what are you doing mate? So yeah, that's a little tip of counteracting Xenon. And you'll know that Xenon has burnt away when this will stop, when this stops moving and the automatic control will stop flickering. Hope that isn't too confusing for you guys. Okay, see you later. Bye bye.